Hello everyone. Hello and thank you to Ed's Gaming and to these channel members. Um, you see Inigo has... People laugh at things they don't believe. It helps them accept the unknown. Okay. Um, Inigo is looking a bit different. I've spent quite a bit of time um, leveling up again my blacksmithing skills. And uh, Inigo is now wearing the Death Brand armor. And um, he also has the two swords that um, you get on that quest as well. And he's decided to use one of them. <laughs> but he can dual wield if he so Buy wants. Uh, just take a little look at what he's got. What is on your mind? Um, I want to look at your equipment. I don't actually want to take anything. Sure. <laughs> so he has Soul Render and Blood Scythe with 206 damage each. And um, apparel, he's got the Death Brand armor. Um, 372 armor rating is pretty good. It's quite a good little kit he's got on him now. Um, deciding not to wear those. I could probably upgrade those a bit more. Um, What's next? Yeah, so hopefully I won't hit him by accident anymore while we're, while we're fighting. Sometimes he gets some friendly fire from me. He should stand out a bit more now. Um, somebody also asked about uh, Dawnbreaker and the two-handed version of Dawnbreaker that I got. Uh, and I've upgraded those as well. So Dawnbreaker is upgraded to 203 damage. And the two-handed Dawnbreaker is on 170. But then my um, my um, two-handed skills aren't as good as my one-handed. So that's, that's why that will be like that for now. Uh, find it. One-handed is on 80 and two-handed is only 52. So... Welcome to the continued adventures of Inigo and Colin. And Mr. Dragonfly, of course. Okay, we're in Riften, and I saw somebody go right in there that we you. haven't seen for a long time, so we're going to go and visit him. What can I do for you? What's on your mind? Even though Fergus and I had our own beds at home, any night our mother was working at the orphanage, we would stay over. We would often wait until she dozed off and lead the other children on daring midnight snack expeditions. Our mother made Fergus and I wear strips of cloth with already taken embroidered on them any time we were visiting her at work. She was worried we would be accidentally adopted. Sometimes, if a child saw a potential parent they did not like the look of, I would lend them my strip of cloth. Oh. Okay, let us get back to it. Okay, where's our friend? Things are much better now that Grelith is dead, but still. I'm sick of this place. Why someone like you want to hang around a place like this? I saw somebody coming here that I know. If I have a little girl of my own, I will call her Atala. I used to hate it, it here. Is a beautiful but it's not so name. bad anymore. Constance is real good to us. I agree. There he is, Aventus Aratino. I was named after the sound you of the lion. You came to visit. It's so you know, much better here with Rahad gone. Really? Thanks to you. You're welcome, kiddo. Stay out of trouble, the... okay? I'm strong and quick and can do any chore you want. Come on, adopt me, please. Um, you'd be spending a lot of time on your own at the moment. 
Maybe when I settle down and get a family, I'll come back. Okay, so we have to do a favour for Lisbeth in Markarth. Let's get that done. Mm -hmm. Let me ask you something. I hope I know the answer. <laughs> Let's discuss combat. My speciality. What are your current tactics? I am being aggressive. And in battle, I am fighting how I choose. Keep doing that. Okay, let us get back to it. You remind me of myself if you get them. Ever now. Lydia was just about to insult Inigo. <laughs> I'm proud of what we've managed to accomplish. Good. Let's try and accomplish some more. I need a catchphrase. I can't have get wrecked because the ESO's already got it. What can I have? Answers in the <laughs> answers in the comments. <laughs> wow, tough. <laughs> That's Lydia. First you, then all of the reach. Yeah, well, come on then. Last mistake. Oh, sneaky. Oh. No, come on. Let's settle this like fools. There we go. And he's dual wielding the swords. Um. 
Lydia seems to have gone her own way. Sneaky. Let us go. on me. <laughs> Don't think my pickpocket skills are high enough, but let's go for it. Thought I heard something. Witness. <laughs> that is at your best. surrounded. Lydia showed up just in the nick of time. relates to a quest with the temple in Markov the um, the little girl ready aha here we are as well take it all beef stew can't make a change I will aid you if I can have a sweet Fair enough okay lead the way let's get out of here what was that? Here we go. Looks very like a dragon to me.
doing in here? Out of the water, you stupid dragon ball! That's it! Land, you filthy beast! Thank you, team. I think I might have to rethink Lydia's city outfit. Um, amazing follower tweaks, you can set three outfits, one for normal adventuring, one for the city, one for home. Um, it appears her city outfit doesn't contain any weapons. <laughs> So I'll sort that out for next time. Oh, let's have that. Let's have it all. We now have five dragon souls. Yes, my friend. What's on your mind? There is a constant war between manufactured geometry and the natural world in Markarth. Nature will win. She always does in Where the end. Okay. What is next on the agenda? Uh, we gotta go see Lisbeth. Dragon souls are smelly. <laughs> Everyone's been talking about you. The guards will have to answer for throwing an innocent person in Sidna Mine. Yeah, that's all in the past. I'm not worried about that anymore. I found the statue that you asked me to find. Oh, there it is. This little gold delight is going to keep us afloat for a while. Thank you. Here's something for your hard work. 1500. That's nice. Be careful and stay safe. Speak to me. Just want to know what you're thinking. Those dragon parts look heavy. See how much you can get for them. Good idea. Lydia looks happy here. The first thought to go through her mind today and it is shopping. Uh, let me ask you. I am all ears. You want to relax for a while? Take it easy. Okay, come and get me when it is time to go. Why don't you sell off those bits of that dragon? They are weighing you down. Hello, friend. Um, I'm going to take Inigo's advice and sell... Trinkets, odds and ends, that sort of thing. Dragon bones. God's blessings on you. You're welcome. Oh, I am sorry, on. Lydia. They do not seem to sell perfume here. Just silly, practical things. <laughs> you want to do some trading? Can I ask you something? Go ahead. Ask away. I want to talk about money. Mm-hmm. Do you need any money? How much have you got right now? A decent amount. Okay, good. Do not get ripped off. 
What is on your mind? You Let's lead, go. I follow. That's it? That's all you've got? <laughs> I've got your back. Okay, I think we'll leave it there for now. We'll call that episode Red 45. Guard craftsmanship in every piece. And uh, we will see you very, very soon. Bye for now. Any go say goodbye for now. Goodbye for now. Tune in next time for more fantastic adventures starring Inigo the Brave, Mr. Dragonfly the Dizzy, and Colin the Amusing.